so delighted to have you all here for this historic day in honor of our class of 2014. Thank you so much, and it's going to be a wonderful afternoon. To my fellow graduates, take a deep breath, smile, soak in this moment, because you are about to graduate from the number one public institution of higher education in the world. For we have a well-honed understanding of the fact that the exercise of free speech is critical to a free society. Even as we know, this freedom comes with great responsibilities and sometimes collateral costs. By guaranteeing this basic right, we also ensure there will be times when we must tolerate speech that offends us. At Berkeley, we celebrate robust debate and a vibrant culture which includes a steady diet of contestation and routine. Make a difference. That's what you owe everyone who came before you and died so you could live free. And that's what you owe everyone who sacrificed for you, like your parents. And it's also what you owe yourself. All right, I thought Bill Maher's speech was great, and I think it was good that the campus let him speak, and it kind of speaks to the, I guess, like how the school stands for street speech, and I think that was. It was really important that he was able to speak today, and I think everything he said was great, and he gave a commencement speech that I'll probably remember for the rest of my life. I thought it was good until the end when he kind of just started, you know, saying stuff that was clearly geared at the people who did not want him, the Cal students who did not want him. I was not comfortable the entire time that he was speaking. It just it wasn't really about what he was saying, it was more about he was not wanted to be the commencement speaker and the university completely disregarded the students' wishes, the graduating students' wishes, and just had their own agenda. Um, being able to adapt to uh, such a different environment uh, with so much diversity and, and, and being able to still handle uh, what I wanted to come out here and accomplish and not get distracted uh, by, by the city and, and you know the fast pace of, of the area. So I think it was pretty good for me to come out here and be able to uh, adapt to the settings and still handle everything I needed to do. Um, I feel like it's amazing. I'm so proud of her and she you know, has been through many struggles and I'm just so excited that she made it through and then now she could go on to the her life, you know.